guys mm. welcome back again to the channel my name is vicky and this is moments with vicky i am so in fact eh, i'm not happy actually i'm not happy with watoni watoni actually made me stay up late to actually see if she will come through with her plans of actually sharing bed with um, kid wire which that was what she actually told Tolani Badge and Trigiti that she was about to shake tables and me I was there like I told you guys in my last video I was there hoping waiting and just saying that I should get the gist like first hand gist and unadulterated so that you guys will just get it straight from the source you get I was just sitting down relaxing and watching and hoping that Watoni actually pulls through with her plan guess what guys she did not even go near there she did not even smell the bed like what don't even told tricky and um, kid wire to stay away from her and i was just like god jesus christ this girl just successfully made me stay up late for nothing like i'm uh, in fact what don't you take your time bro. next time don't try to ginger what you cannot do don't try to say what you cannot do you understand so guys welcome back to my channel if you are new please before we move on hit on the red subscribe button to subscribe to the channel and turn on your notification bell so that whenever i post a video you will just hear pakam, 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 pakam. vicky moments with vicky has posted a video and then you will run along to the channel to watch my video all right guys let's let me talk about what actually happened yesterday so actually yesterday i was actually complaining to tochi i think is it was it tochi or um lacon or something i think lacon that um erica is actually making him feel like saying that he's a playboy and all that and he doesn't like that and then watoni is taking things too serious and in fact he's just going to just let them be and not bother himself anymore because he likes erica but erica is saying that he is a playboy you get and that was it and then erica now went to just um, um, um erica now went to just lacon and the rest of the housemate that um kid wire is actually not too i don't know how is she she actually there's a way she actually placed her words which i'm trying to get she said that kid wire if she is blind she cannot actually date kid wire because kid wire is more of a flirty person only flirts with her say touches her wants to have a sexual talk with her like flirty per se and you know there is nothing intellectual there's no deep conversation that they have between the both of them and she doesn't really like that because she has she likes people she actually have deep conversation with and i'm like oh wow <laughs> you know but and if you look at it properly kid wire is more of a very flirty person kid wire likes flirting with girls like catching his screws likes making you feel love making you feel important you get not I, I don't even feel like most of his words are true that's personal so erica maybe sensed it you know so that's what she said that she can't she does don't want to have anything to do with kid wire and she likes people that have deep conversation with her you know and then moving on they can actually just revealed that like like not that we don't know we the viewers we actually know this thing that lacon is absolutely in love with uh, do i say in love or lacon fancies erica and nengi you get and then yesterday she confessed he was uh, yesterday he confessed and he was like if he actually wins the head of us of course he's going to choose erica lacon is one person that i feel like he's trying to guard himself not to lose focus on what he came to big brother to do yes. there are a few of them which he actually likes or he which he actually maybe if they were outside he would have shot his shot he gets but lacon is more focused on the game so he's 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 already exhibiting that attitude of he actually likes erica very much you get but i think erica doesn't fancy him like that erica just like lacon's intellectual ability like likes kid wire for his physique so he's more or less like looking for a lacon in the physics of a um, kid wire or looking for a kid wire in the in intellectual of lacon i don't know if that makes sense at all I, I don't know if i just rambled there you get so that's just it's i don't think erica wants to have anything serious to do with kid wire and then let us move on to the coco the hot gist that just happened this morning there is fire on the mountain run 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 a big big fire that's i don't know what what is actually going on between new and vim they were having a conversation this morning i think they had a misunderstanding and then new was actually talking to v and v is actually trying to spend more time with other housemates and then neo was not having it neo was like how do you spend more time with people and then you're telling me that because v was telling him that she wants to spend more time with other housemates but at night she will he will have her 
on his bed and he was like what am i having you on my bed for what are we going to do on my bed i think if you like somebody you spend more time with the person and i'm like i think neo for some for for some way neo is right and v is right one well, neo if you're in love with somebody i think you spend more time with the person that doesn't mean that you have to neglect other housemates but now v wants to eat his her cake and have it like she wants to have new to her side and also be everywhere you get and you remember that v was the housemate that actually said that she had never had hold down a, a relationship for six months she has never had a relationship that exceeded six months and then they were having this misunderstanding it got to a point they told each other fuck you fuck you and then they walked away on each other and that was it i think that neil now is saying that now went to speak with eric and was like she wants to be with everybody she wants to spend more time with everybody and not with her and then she's trying to say that i have to accept that person that she doesn't see he doesn't see life that way he doesn't see relationships that way and then v on the other hand is saying that neil is too much for her in the sense that he wants all the time or all the attention to himself but she cannot give him that and i just think that there is a fracas there you get because you people have to come to a common ground you have to understand v is saying that what neo wants she cannot give him and neo is like v does not deserve me and i am like what are you guys doing are you guys about to fight are you guys about to destroy this ship that we are already hyping you get that's just what they have just been going back and forth this morning and then v walked away from neo neo walked away from v and then she went to sit down outside and then Nengi went to ask her what's going on and she's like neo is a little bit too much for her you get so i think the mentality of these two people has um it's what is actually causing the issue they ha they both have two different kind of mentalities you get but i think that they can work on something they can work it out if they actually make up their mind to work out because when neo was speaking to eric neo actually said that v said that she cannot be like lilu and i understand perfectly you don't have to come to the house and forget about the game if V wants to be with other people, it is necessary for she to have a relationship with other housemates and not act like Lilo, who came into the house and she and um, um, Eric are just bread and butter. So it's also good to make it balanced while you still have your relationship. I don't know if that is what uh, Neo is expecting of V, you get, but if that is what is expecting i don't see it like it is actually the right thing to do and also on the other hand v doesn't expect to be in a relationship with someone or to have an affair with someone and just not neglect the person hoping that your only time of being with the person should be on the bed that it doesn't work so we are just seeing that the relationship it's going a little bit like well let us not say it's going south they are having a little bit of fracas and we are here to actually watch them settle their matter and we just hope they actually settled it because we're already hyping this relationship and we really want it to work because they are part of the contents we are actually interested in and last but not the least guys i don't know what is wrong with brighto brighto has succeeded in actually pushing everybody at towards everybody if you come to brighto ah and i like this person brighto will give you go ahead all right try your luck you go to this person you tell, tell bright uh, bright i think this person i like this person brighto is gingering everybody to date everybody and i don't just understand what in what bright moves are bright is it's, it's becoming funny and then nengi is a girl that i feel that she wants to be everywhere like nengi wants to just flirt with everybody especially if you give her the green light of i like you or you look cute or you look beautiful you're a pretty girl nengi just seizes the opportunity to just flaunt herself back and forth with you nengi doesn't want to be held down by one person at this point nengi does not just nengi don't want to see that place the housemates are planning to play a game this night too, and they call it dark room me i don't know what dark room is so please if you know leave it in the comment section they are planning to play a game called dark room and the the way they are planning this game i think is even going to be more do i use the word vulgar or it's going to be even more dirty than we have seen before so our eyes are fixed to actually see the end result of this game and i just hope with the way they are planning it saying that if you're not ready you won't enter the room you will just stay on your own until when you when we finish playing the game because we are going to go the air stream i just hope biggie allows them to play this game so that let us check something you get because tables are about to be shaking tables because the singles association of the house are about to break tables they are about to scatter things and that's their plan for tonight that's the essence of the game they are um planning on playing you get so i'll be bringing you guys the gist i hope you enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up and i just hope v and new 
they don't scatter this sheep that we are already happy about give this video a thumbs up leave me a comment down below and please do not forget to follow me on my other channel at vicky m vicky e m i love you guys and i will see you guys in my next one